So it's 2018 and it is almost on the cusp of Ayala's group, the 29 faces, starting February 1. So I need to get some background done. I went ahead and filmed this because I have some friends of mine, Del Rio, a bat, um, sunflower, Michael, and some others wondering how I did the backgrounds on the last set um, that I did for Ayala's in September. This is watercolor paper with just some acrylic paint and I'm just throwing what colors on there for this theme. And so that's it's easy, it's easy as that. You guys were asking me about how I did the purples with the greens. Just the same similar thing that I'm doing here. Once this is done, then I measure the... I. You can do the um, Ayala's 29 faces any way you want. I choose to uh, not only do them in her group, video it, and I do mine in ATCs, which are artist trading cards. I belong to a um, community that trades artist cards as well. Um, you can even sell these, but they're called something different. Uh, I can't think off the top of my head what they are, but they sell them like trading cards and like you would football cards or baseball cards or any of that. So once this is dry, it takes a little bit to dry. And being that it's watercolor paper, I had to anchor down all four corners and in the middle so that it didn't curl. Um, a lot of people, when you do paintings with this type of um, watercolor paper, will use painter's tape and tape it down on a hard surface so that they can do their paintings in it and not roll. But being that I am going to be cutting this up into uh, the size of your average trading card, I didn't want to do all that with the tape and whatnot. So you can see this and I'll get back with you towards the end of this video and we will continue on with the next. Here I am uh, getting ready to cut it. This was kind of a big paper, bigger than I typically use in my little uh, slicer here. I'm cutting this up into what's going to be my, uh, my cards. And this is going to be the background. I think that this year I don't do men's face as much. I've had several people ask me about that. So I think this um, trading cards will be done in men's faces somehow, some way. We'll see how well it goes. It's very, very much out of my comfort zone, so it should be a good challenge. So this is just me cutting things up, getting them ready on the backs here. Uh, with that will be the background to their faces or blended into their faces. We shall see how it all comes up in the end. And the very end of this video, what you're going to see is after they're all cut up, then I turn them all over and I have a stamp that tells you on there, um, the art, it's an artist trading card, the date, it asks um, the theme, and it'll ask you the number. And since there's 29 faces, it'll be one of 29, two of 29 until it's all completed. And then it'll have my signature and my social media contact on the back because um, as these go live in February and as always it'll be Wednesdays that you'll see these um, when I post them in the group um, and in the artist uh, trading card group accordingly it'll be they'll be subject to trading at that point and I give them one they give me one that type of thing and the back will tell them what number of the 29 they have it's very simple it's not complicated at all so on Wednesday, starting the last week of February, you should start seeing these come through. Anyway, I will see you guys in the next video. Have a great day.